Hello everyone, this is Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 1. Let's check the model number. It's right here. It's very difficult to read. It says 15 AM and 7. So what happened? It's a quite brand new machine. They used a couple of months. Now, when they turn it on, it's auto restart like this. It turns on, gets off turns on off okay what could be the reason so after research I found that is happened from the bad updates which means the actual Windows system is corrupted okay to solve this problem the best and easy way I mean the permanent solution to reinstall the Windows freshly so if you do have any data back it up first how are you gonna do that because system is not working Never mind, open it up, pull out the SSD, copy it to the different machine, okay? And if you don't have any important data, you are good to go. What you should do, switch it off completely. Fine. Make sure you have Windows 10 or 11 thumb drive in UEFI. What I'm going to do, I'm going to connect in here any USB port and then I'm going to make sure the charger is connected and then on the right hand side if you really look into it you're gonna check there is a little hole in there right so while it's switched off do it like this it's gonna turn on and you see it doesn't on and off on and off so it seems the system got an issue now let's get into BIOS hit enter and this is the BIOS system now go to right hand side which is configuration from there you need to check if there is anything called TPM nothing in there let's go to security from here we can see the secure boot let me show you make sure this is enabled once it enable hit enter fine then there is nothing else to do go back to boot which is that one and as you can see it says USB boot is enabled that's fine and okay and then second one uh, boot priority okay as you can see there are two lists okay the bottom one is my USB so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna press F6 to put it on the top F6 you see now I'm going to save it and exit by pressing F10. Do it. Hit enter. And leave it. Now it should go back to Windows Setup page. And then we'll reinstall the system and everything will be fine. That's what we're going to check. Alright, so this is loading up. We're gonna hit next this is quite simple uh, if this is first time also you don't make any mistake because it's quite straightforward now we're gonna accept the terms and conditions select the internal drive while to install the windows and I don't have any important data so I'm going to delete all of them but if you do have any data please don't delete it before you make sure you take the backup if your PC doesn't work, no problem. You can pull out the SSD connected to different donor laptop as a external drive and you can copy everything. So let's delete all of them one by one. And then the system would copy everything. And once the installation done, we can give it a check and see if you do have same problem or not. Already we can see the system, I mean, the laptop is not keep restarting itself
So I can see it's booting correctly. There is no any issue. It doesn't keep restarting like before. So definitely that was a operating system issue, not any hardware issue. Hope the video would help. If you do like, please subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.